My name is Dr. Yusra Amokhtar and I'm a dentist and facial aesthetic practitioner based in Liverpool. The story of the clinic is one of resilience, passion and a culmination of years of hard work. Um, what jumped out with Dr. Yusra Clinic is they advocate well-being as well and the fact that they took the time to have a consultation prior was really important to me. Because of my face shape had changed, I would look in the mirror now and I wasn't recognising who I was seen anymore. The minute that I came into the clinic, there was like no judgement whatsoever. And Dr Yusra and her team kind of assessed just me and said, well actually this is probably going to be a better treatment and I really, really, really appreciated that. The Blundell Sands Clinic is home to five specialist treatment rooms we have the aesthetic suite for all injectables, the skin suite where we examine our patient's skin with the Observe 520 and provide over 20 skin peels and dermatology grade facials, as well as treat acne, pigmentation and rosacea to restore skin health. We also have the Mind Suite where we have our clinical psychologist and she offers cognitive behavioural therapy and psychological interventional therapies where appropriate. We also have the Sculpt Suite where we offer high intensity focus ultrasound to sculpt and tighten the face and cool sculpting to target stubborn pockets of fat. We also offer a holistic weight loss program and we work with registered nutritionists and a pharmacist prescriber and a gynecologist. We've invested heavily in gold standard FDA approved technology from cool sculpting to intracell, secret pro radio frequency microneedling and CO2 laser, hydrofacial, endolift, and the U225 PRP device. We've left no stone unturned and we are committed to the pursuit of excellence in everything that we do with the main aim of ensuring patient care and patient safety is absolutely at the forefront of everything we do. The results are insane. I would definitely recommend it to any and everyone. Oh. I know. Thank you so much. What? <laughs> How did you do? <laughs> that is amazing. My journey into aesthetics started when I was eight years old. I had a bad accident that left me needing surgery to my upper and lower lip and my gums. I remember going into school the next day and I had black stitches on my lips and I looked terrifying. And my teacher asked me to sit at the back of the class so that I wouldn't scare everyone. I was bothered by my scar for so many years and people would ask me about it all the time. So I understood back then the relationship between physical appearance and confidence. And really it was then that I decided to go into healthcare and I knew I wanted to help people. So that's why I became a dentist, it's why I went into head and neck surgery and then into facial aesthetics and really why I focus on facial reconstruction. I really want to change the stigma and the public perception that we, what we do is skin deep because I know that it's not. And I know that behind every transformation you see is a story, a person and a reason why that person has come in to seek treatment. I know that my patients are impacted by these treatments, not just physically, but on a psychological level. And so my why, my reason and my motivation is empowering my patients. My vision extends far beyond just a business. I see myself as every woman's advocate and I want to see a world where women, regardless of colour, ethnic background or religious belief, are invited to take an equal seat at the table. I want to see a world where there is a true understanding that there is power in diversity and it is not to be feared, ignored or dismissed, but cultivated and revered. To me, female empowerment isn't about making women stronger, because women are already strong. To me, it's about changing the way that the world perceives that strength and it takes collective action, starting with us, to make that change.